I'm Cookie Gaynor, and this is a quick step-by-step -step of selecting the right image from the download class materials on Craftsy for my class, Digitizing Machine Embroidery Design. I'm working in version 10, and up at the top there are three tabs. The same type of tab system is used in version 9, and if you're working on an earlier PE design, then simply look it up in your manual, and you want to look up the word image. When I click the image tab, it pertains only to graphics. So when I click open, it will not open embroidery designs, but rather graphic files. I'm going to click from file. You have to know where your files are downloaded. Mine were downloaded to my desktop. And then I created a small folder, and I called it DMED, the abbreviation. I'll double click. And once I unzip my files, it will open up, and this is a small representation. Artwork for all file types is what you need for your graphics for all the lessons. These are other file formats, and when you see this file here, New Art, this has nothing to do with graphics, and this creates confusion. This is for the Artista file format, .art. So if your machine doesn't use .art, or you're not using the Artista software, which I assume you're not if you're watching this video, then you do not need to pay attention to this folder. You will need your PEZ folder and you will need your artwork. I did not download the PEZ folder. If I open this up, you will notice that all my lesson plans are done in order here. So if you're looking for the shaded flower, lesson 8, just come down here and click on this and it will appear. If you like to have this done more as icons in Windows, then that's a Windows function and you would just change that over here. I prefer details. And click open and begin your lesson.